Here we got a 1929 Ford Roadster, which uh, very much like uh, back in the day type style, you know, pull the running boards off, uh, freaking pull the fenders off, lower it, strip off the unnecessary weight because you go fast, you got the old flathead in there, right? This is really much, and it's smart that you paint it a lot less money than chroming it, man. A hell of a lot less bullshit. You gotta get some rust in that chrome, you know? I'm afraid of chrome and stuff, man. It's got the old shifter in there. But this is like a regular, this is more like the old style hot rods, man. It's got drum brakes. True wire wheels. I'm not sure how you lower this bad boy, man. There you go. It's a 53 Ford truck manual trench or three speed floor shifter. 1940 drum, 8-inch Ford rear drum, drum, brakes, 32 Ford frame, 1940 spindles. You know, this is a, actually in an early 50s, in the mid 50s, you would not see a hot rodder going around in a 55 Chevy. That was more like the 60s or late 60s or even the early 70s because a high rider just couldn't afford a brand new car. They were doing this kind of stuff, actually. This is really very much like the real deal. And it's done a lot prettier, though. But it's done like... It just looks better because it doesn't have the chrome on it, to tell you the truth. It doesn't have all that... It has some chrome on it. But it's just nice the way it's like this two tone of like brown and uh, I don't know if that's like a brownish gray or whatever. It's like a tannish, tannish gray or something. But this is very much how they would do it back then in the 50s. Except it wouldn't be done as nice as this. But that's what you would do. You'd get a 30 something car and put 50 something. You find like a modern 53 truck transmission, a manual transmission. Yeah. I wonder how you drop that thing though. It's got all like uh, drum brakes on it stuff. This thing's sweet, man. It's like the real deal right here, man. All the way. This is what you would see in the early 50s as a hot rodder, for real. This is really like the real legit thing. Knock off wire wheels and all that other bus stuff. Three speed actually is good enough, man, to tell you the truth. Believe it or not, as long as you got a torquey motor, that's all you need.